Good morning. Obviously, I am not at home because you can see the White House behind me. Here is one question I will put out. And we all know that I've put this question out before for those who've seen the video. And here's the question. 43 years from now, something does not happen. What happens 43 years later? Now think about it. I'm going to give you a little bit of time and I'm going to restate the question or restate my statement. Now, don't mix up my wording or did I already mix you up with the way I worded this? Something, something, what can that something be? Imagine there is no more moon cycle. If there is no more moon cycle, will there be an ocean wave? Will the, ocean, will the moon control the oceans? Do, does the moon control the oceans? The energy of the moon, is there an energy in the moon? And they say a woman runs by the moon's cycle. Should it be that it's true that the moon no longer has a cycle and women no longer run the cycle, therefore knocking and leaving and crushing and eliminating the cycle of pregnancy. If a woman and women or women no longer have the capacity of having children from today for the next 43 years and beyond, in 43 years there shall be no more births on this planet, making every woman that has a chance of making a child 54 years old or 55 years old and rare and in between will anyone have a child at this point. Therefore, 40 years later, there will be nobody left on this planet. So in a total of period time of 80 years from this point in time, there should be nobody left on the planet. Should we run through a period of the next 43 years where no woman gets pregnant? Now, since we're going to take it from the child's birth at age zero, I will put 55 years to the cycle now. If no one gives birth in 55 years, all humanity will fall to zero. So next time you're thinking about whether you should go out with your child, with a friend, or if you're not nice to somebody, think, think about the reality of this world. Not one person will remain on this planet if no longer the moon exists. The moon meaning the period of time, the energy movement of the ocean, or the cycle of a woman's period bringing on the chance of pregnancy, bringing on or in life. Now, I may not talk with all the best wording. My English is the way it is, however you take it, however you can twist to make it to be what it is. But the truth and the core of this video is, if we have no pregnancies by women in the next 55 years, a very short period of time, we will all die off and there will be none of us left on this planet. So everything we seek out to do today, what is my question here? What is my question here? What is my question here? What's my question here? I put out this video because it's not perfect. But what is my question here? Or what do you understand? How should you take this video? Not care? Should you be friendlier to the people uh, next to you because of it? Um, what is our attitudes towards people and how um, do we get these? Uh, I don't even know which way to word this. Uh, it would be nice if I would sit down in some of my videos with somebody else asking and, and like in three people. So I don't have to sit here and ask myself all these questions prolonging my videos. Working as a team. Working as a team. Someone protecting your back. Protecting somebody else's back. I ran out of food. So somebody brought me some food because they noticed I ran out of food. 
I had a broken leg. I was on the side of the road. The wolves were after me. Somebody came to protect me. The wolf was in danger in the middle of the road. I was driving my car. I stopped and I helped the wolf over to the side of the road and helped the wolf. The wolf was hungry. I fed the wolf. The wolf was thirsty. I brought the wolf water. The wolf didn't drink. That wasn't my fault. Some people will watch this video saying, what is he saying? Is he saying this on purpose to persuade me? But I don't know you. But since he's now in these new groups, and obviously because they know who my, what my name is, of uh, what I've done, they'll come here and search this and use my words in the way they believe they are or have them twisted by someone else they may share it with. So who I am on Mr. Tack Pan's remains and what I've represented over the past nine years that I've been here is all the same. I take what I see out there in the, what they call real world, and I bring it here and I question it. Raphael 7286 in a constellation of Pegasus. There's a reason for that code. Thank you for watching this video.